One step forward and another back. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today I have some Saturday cleaning motivation for you. So if you guys have some cleaning you need to get done, let's get it done together. First, we're gonna be starting out in the kitchen and my house isn't too bad today. So I am just going to get everything picked up and put away. Today I have a lot of random cleaning that I'm gonna be getting done that I've been putting off. And then I will have a simple recipe that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys towards the end of this video. Now that I have the kitchen picked up, I am going to move on to the clean dishes, get them put away. Let me know in the comments if you guys are cleaning with me or if you're here for the cleaning motivation and what you guys are up to on this Saturday morning. Typically on Saturday mornings, Owen has soccer games. Today we have a soccer game in the afternoon, but I absolutely love going and watching his soccer games. If you guys have been following me on Instagram, you know that my oldest daughter, Victoria, has been doing a ton of cheer competitions and we actually have a couple weeks off before we go to a very large competition in Anaheim and we absolutely love doing things like this with our kids. Smiling like that, I can never resist it. Smiling like that, I can never resist it. I do have a few things that I'm going to be washing by hand and I am just using the Method dish soap. So I did purchase some new pots and pans from Walmart. I honestly haven't bought new pots and pans since we moved into our first apartment, which was probably about 10 years ago. And I just got the cheapest thing that I could afford at Walmart back then. And they are definitely not very good quality. And anything else that I have is because my mom has given it to me, but I've done a lot of research and these are the ones that I came up with that I wanted to get. I think that they are beautiful. I've cooked with them a few times and they do such a good job definitely not like a cooking expert or know anything about cookware but I honestly thought they were so pretty I read up on them read the reviews and I decided that these were the ones that I wanted to go with I thought that they were a really good deal I had looked for some at Target and they were a little bit more and they just didn't seem like they were as good as quality but I will try to link them for you guys if you would like to check them out 
So typically I do not talk about the negative and rude comments that I get, but I just feel that it's something that should be addressed and something that I want to talk about. So when I started my YouTube channel and I started doing cleaning motivation, it became really important for me to show my real life, which like today, my house is pretty clean, it didn't need a lot of work, but I had some things that I wanted to get done and I want to show that to you guys. When my house is a mess, I want to show that to you guys too because I know that a lot of people can relate to that. Especially as a mom of three, when I get sick, when I get busy, when I don't want to get up and spend my day cleaning, my house does come a complete disaster. So I'm just going to read you guys the comments so you guys can get the whole context. Um, but it, somebody just said, I unsubscribed to your channel because I don't believe people really live that dirty every day. It looks staged for viewing. And one, my house does not look like that every single day. It was in my last video and I'll link it for you guys so y'all can go and check it out. But I would never stage my home to be messy. I hate cleaning up the mess. It drives me crazy. I love to clean like today, this video, I was feeling good. I was feeling motivated because this is the type of cleaning I like to do. I do not like when my house gets super messy and honestly, it's such a struggle and it's really hard for me to get started when my house just becomes a complete disaster which I know a lot of other women also deal with that. You get lots of anxiety, it's very stressful, and you never know what somebody is going through. And on my channel, I have always wanted women to come to my channel and never feel judged. I never want you to come to my channel and think, why can she do X, Y, and Z and I can't? Because I know that I have visited tons of channels on YouTube and I always think, you know, I, I can't get all that done. And it almost makes you feel bad. And I never want anyone to ever feel that way. And I think that one, as a person, I'm not defined by how clean my house is, how dirty my house is. That does not define me or you as a person. And that you never know what somebody is going through. You have no idea. Instead of saying, I can't believe that people live in a dirty house like this, why don't you ask yourself, instead of judging, ask why, what is going on with them? Because as mothers, we are stressed. It is hard, okay? Just because you can keep your house clean doesn't mean that I can always keep my house clean. I have bad days and I have bad weeks. And honestly, I don't talk about that on my YouTube channel because I want it to be uplifting and I want to motivate you guys. But I think that this is something that needs to be talked about. Because instead of judging people, why don't we have a little bit of compassion? Ask them how they're doing, how they're feeling, how has their week been going, what is going on, what is wrong? You know, giving them ideas of how they could maybe keep up with their house or whatever you feel that they, you know, need a little bit of guidance in instead of judging and being rude. Give them guidance, give them your words of experience and how you did x y and z you're never going to fix somebody's problem by being rude and belittling them and putting them down all you're doing is making them feel worse as a person and i feel that in just the last few years like we've lost so much compassion and and we judge so hard and i feel like in 2022 like why are we still judging women for how clean their house is and i didn't mean for this to turn into a rant but when i read that comment because i get so many comments from women saying thank you so much for showing the real life thank you for showing the real mess i'm a mom of 
three, four children. I'm trying to keep up with the mess and it's so hard. I get comments like this so often and it made me think of those women because not only are you putting me down but you're also putting down these women who can relate to me and it just i can take the hate all day long it doesn't i mean of course it bothers you to a certain point but it just made me think about all the other women who are out there struggling and we we say so often don't compare yourself to all these other youtube moms that can keep up with their house that's so perfect but then when i show you a real life messy house it's like you do all you just get hate for it and no matter what i'm going to be real on my channel and i'm going to show you guys the real life and i hope you all enjoy it and i think that's okay that if you don't want to see a super messy house i think that everybody is entitled to their opinion i just think that you don't have to say it in a rude way and i just hope that you guys enjoy the content that you see and i know that i typically don't talk about things on here like this but if your house is messy like my house gets sometimes just know that that is okay and completely normal it feels like I'm drunk on ya. Yeah. It feels like I'm drunk on ya. Yeah. Oh! Alright, guys, so once again, sorry for the rant, but I did feel it was something that needed to be talked about. We also got a lot of cleaning done while I was talking. Um, I had taken apart my couch when I was looking for something, and then I noticed that it needed to be vacuumed out. So I left it all apart and then you all saw Mickey up there lounging on the mountain of pillows and then my fans desperately need it to be dusted off also and I'm vacuuming my couch now after I dust it and then I will be vacuuming. Loving me was all you tried when you were around I've been told too many times now yeah, loving me was all you tried when you were around I've been told too many times now But somewhere going high Looking for a new star Yeah, somewhere going high Looking for a new star For a new star Now I'm in my bedroom and my fan was really dirty. It was probably worse than the fan out in the living room. I rarely ever turn this fan off and I ended up turning it off the other day and I realized just how dusty it was. Um, I actually had to run to Target and get a new duster because somehow I lost my old one. I have no idea where I put it at. So I had to wait a few days until I was able to run there and get a new duster. But y'all look at how much dust I got off and I have a ton of dust on my floor also.
was at the wrong place at the right time Cause suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes We were conversing under the night sky When you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I did clean my room yesterday so there's no need to wipe down the furniture or do any other cleaning than vacuuming in here and now we're gonna be moving into the kitchen and I just have a super easy recipe that I wanted to share with you guys first I'm gonna be making rice in my rice cooker and I don't have a ton of a kitchen appliances but this is one appliance that I love I really don't like cooking my rice on the stovetop typically I will just buy the one minute rice that you can put in the microwave but this makes it a little bit easier and now I'm gonna be air frying my salmon I picked the salmon up from Target and you guys it was really good Elvis and I both agree that it was definitely something that we will be purchasing again So here I'm plating the rice and then I'm also going to be adding broccoli and the salmon and then I'm going to be adding some soy sauce and then to Elvis's I added some sriracha and it was so good. I highly suggest this really simple meal for you guys but that is pretty much it for today and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to give it a like and if you haven't already go ahead and hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation. Thank you guys so much for being here today and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Don't wanna be shy